Well, guys, red tide is real and pollution is real. Uh, climate change may be debatable, but pollution is real. And it has made its way uh, to the Atlantic Ocean. I'm in the beautiful Palm Beach County. This is Juneau Beach. And for the past week or so, there's been a red tide, uh, which is caused by a variety of factors, not just pollution, um, and, a wa and a variety of things here in South Florida with the water management system. It's scratchy. <clears throat> um, I felt the air, you know, driving up Highway A1A, and, and I've been here so many different times uh, here in Palm Beach County. This is Juneau Beach. That's the Juneau Beach Pier. This is one of the most beautiful beaches in all of Florida. And my throat is so scratchy, and it's never been like this. Uh, I've been here so many times, and I'm not exaggerating. I mean, it's breathable. Um, it's breathable, but you feel it. Uh, you do not feel clean air. You feel a scratchy throat. And there are people on the beach, uh, but I don't see anyone in the water. Um, and I've on a Saturday, 88-degree uh, weather, I've never seen the beach this empty. Um, <clears throat> I'm sure the only people sitting there are probably people on vacation that just don't want to... There's like two people sitting there. No one's in the water, but <clears throat> you know, there's no way you want to breathe that in all day. Um, it's just an absolute disgrace um, that's got to this point uh, to just ruin this uh, beautiful, beautiful uh, ocean, uh, beautiful waterways of Florida, Okeechobee, uh, you know, a big a lot of it stems from the Okeechobee uh, Lake in South Central Florida, and then which is basically is like a drainage system for much of uh, the Orlando northern area. And there's a bunch of farms. And part of it is to do with the um, uh, the waste, whether it's uh, cow manure waste or whether it's human sec sep septic systems, human waste that all drains down the Okeechobee. Um, lake and Okeechobee Lake has like a dike which was a man-made um, dam system put in place about 70 years ago to prevent hurricanes from mass flooding that lake and and when the lake reservoir gets too uh, big uh, too high what they do is they drain Lake Okeechobee <clears throat> uh, usually into southwest uh, but they've been draining it and it's you know made its way also to the eastern uh, point of Florida and uh, you know the different bacteria and algae that grows in that water due to the warm climate tropical climate in Florida due to the the waste that finds its way uh, through there whether it's because of the cattle ranches or whether it's because of human human septic systems all those factors um, <clears throat> man my throat is scratchy it just um, when, when Lake Okeechobee uh, dumps some of that water to relieve the pressure off the dam system uh, it just spreads the the algae and the different bacterias and um, and that's where we're at I mean it has happened before over the course of um, a few decades but it does seem to be getting a little bit more severe <clears throat> um, so again there's a variety of factors but uh, it's just to, to me <clears throat> I, I mean I, I can't believe it. I'm not gonna stay here much longer I'm, I'm getting out of here uh, and I never thought I'd want to say I would get out of uh, Juno Beach area and I'm coming back I mean, but uh, Just making my way through this area today and uh, it's a shame it, It's a shame that's gotten to this point But sometimes in life things have to get to this point where uh, people don't joke about pollution people mock uh, Climate change and, all that. and climate change may be not real. I don't, you know, no one really knows There's not enough data to prove that you know, but pollution's real and how you manage your water system and, and the regulations you put around things, that's real and that's needed. Never forget that. Don't let these politicians fool you. But I'll tell you what's going to happen. If these million-dollar homes, because let me tell you something, this is a big money area, Palm Beach County, uh, down this strip, Highway A1. If these big money homes, if they lose their value um, because of this, if this is like a long-term thing, it may be a short-term thing, it may be over in a week. But if this ever stays for a consistent period of time and all those million-dollar homes down this highway that goes for hours... The whole system will change because there ain't no way those those big money people will let that slide. Uh, but I just want to share that with you. It's real. I mean, you, you you don't think things are real until they affect you, until you feel them, until you <clears throat> until you have trouble breathing at the beautiful beaches of Florida. So I just want to share this video with you. And uh, 
go from there.